Hey guys, so I wanted to talk to you a little bit about my my grouchy post. <laughs> um, I am on Maverick. I have had Hep C for 20 years. I've been trying to get treated for 10. And finally, my insurance is treating me. And so that is something that I should and always have been very grateful for. I get worn down. The physical, the, the physical pain from so many things gets to be too much sometimes. And waking up with my eye all swollen and all fucked up just really sent me off the edge. But as far as my treatment, I am so grateful to be on Maverick. I am so grateful. I've had hep C from my intravenous drug use, from my coping, from when my daughter died, my daughter Poppy. I've had it that long. And it's the silent killer. You know, when they diagnosed me, they gave me about 10 years before I would need a, a liver transplant. And it's been well over 10. So I have a lot to be great, grateful for. And I just wanted to kind of set that straight. You know, I have had a moment. I got overwhelmed. And this channel is about being real. And that's real. You know, us moms who, especially who have children who are, you know, kind of high needs. Um, we get worn out sometimes. And I guess just sharing that makes me feel like, you, you know, you, you can share that. It is totally okay to be overwhelmed and exhausted and worn to the bone. What's not okay is if you stay in it. And I never intend to stay in it. You know, I had some tearful moments this morning. My head is aching. My face hurts. And um, the reality of it, though, is I need to have nothing but gratitude. If I didn't have this medicine, the other option is death. Hep C is the silent killer, and I've had it for a very, very long time. So my gratitude is great. My head is in the right place. I always, always, always do all the things not feeling well. So today's just no different, you know. I just got a little overwhelmed, but today's no different. As moms, we get up and we do what we have to do, right? That's just what being a mom is, sick or not. And I don't have much of an opportunity to have like a ton of help. My parents help me when they can. You know, my boyfriend helps me when he can. But other than that, it's on me. And it doesn't matter if I feel like I'm dying or not. It's just on me. <laughs> so again, you know, I apologize for coming on here and complaining. But again, I don't because I want this to be a safe space for people to be able to feel free to to vent, to to feel, you know, upset, to be able to communicate. You know, you can go to the community and we can have a chat. Um, we can chat in the comments. If you're going through hard times or if you're just having a shitty day, like I had a really shitty morning, all mine's fear-based, you know. I'm so afraid of sickness and I've got so much going on right now. And, and that's where it comes from. But the bottom line is, is I am so grateful for the medicine that I'm on. Um... I am. And this all went into the works before I started learning how to heal myself. And um, so what I'm doing is just manifesting along with taking the medicine. And it's going to work. And I'm going to be healed. And I'm not going to have a sick liver anymore. And I'm going to have energy. More energy to play with my kid. And to do the things that I need to do and to work. And it's going to be amazing. So I hope I don't ever find myself being grouchy about it again because it's it's a lifesaver and it's a godsend. So anyways, I just wanted to kind of set that straight. And I hope you guys do have a great evening and I'll see you a little later.